Hello and Happy New Year. I know it's only November 29th, but yesterday was the first Sunday of Advent. And so here at the Church of the Advent, uh, we're getting ready to start a brand new church year. The word Advent means coming, and it is a time spent preparing ourselves for the celebration of Christmas when we remember the coming once long ago of Christ in a manger in Bethlehem. It's also a time to reflect upon the many ways that Christ still comes into our lives in the present time and his promise to come again in glory at the end of the ages. Uh, to help with our Advent reflections and devotions, uh, we have again this year made available copies of a devotional booklet published by Living Compass. This year's booklet is entitled Practicing Patience with All Your Heart, Soul, Strength, and Mind. It includes readings for each day from now until Christmas. Copies are available in the narthex of the church in the Parish Community Life Center and uh, the reception area in Satterley Hall and in the hallway outside the Olney Chapel. In many ways, uh, Advent is a time of waiting. And I think it's fair to say that we're not very good at waiting most of the time. You can remember how difficult, how hard it was to wait for Christmas when you were a child. And I think that few of us got any better at waiting as we grew older. Especially in this modern time of, of, of instant gratification, where with one click of a key on the computer, you can order something and have it delivered to your door the very next day. Add to that the pandemic that we've been in the last year and a half and are waiting now for the return to some semblance of ordinary, normal life. Uh, you can see then that uh, the theme of this year's booklet, Practicing Patience, is very timely indeed. In the first devotion, the one for yesterday, Lisa Sanuta uh, uses uh, an analogy by Hope Jaren of a seed to help understand patience. A seed knows how to wait. Most seeds wait for at least a year before starting to grow. A cherry seed can wait for a hundred years, no problem. What exactly each seed is waiting for is known only to that seed. Some unique trigger combination of temperature, moisture, light, and many other things is required to convince the seed to jump off the deep end and to take its chance, to take its one and only chance to grow. The wisdom of the humble seed teaches that patience is not about the thing we urgently want to hurry up and happen. Patience is about growth. Yes, Advent is the season of waiting, expectantly waiting for coming of Christ. But as we develop the ability to wait patiently, we can also have it as a season for growth. So, let's slow down for the next several weeks and pay attention to the climate of our lives listening patiently, like a seed, for the unique triggers, which for us are the spirits leading us to become God's, what God has created us to be, a community of faith that shows forth Christ's light in the world. So, Happy New Year. Have a blessed Advent. And remember, always remember that God loves you and so do we.